strengthening of enzymes. Factors affecting chemical equilibrium Several factors can affect chemical equilibrium. These factors include changes in temperature, pressure, and concentration. Temperature Hanging the temperature of a chemical reaction can affect the equilibrium position. In an exothermic reaction, increasing the temperature will shift the equilibrium position to the left, favoring the reactants. In an endothermic reaction, Increasing the temperature will shift the equilibrium position to the right, favoring the products. The opposite is true for decreasing the temperature. Pressure Changing the pressure of a chemical reaction can affect the equilibrium position only if the reaction involves gases. In a reaction where the number of moles of gases on the reactant side is greater than on the product side. Increasing the pressure will shift the equilibrium position to the right. Favoring the side with fewer moles of gases. The opposite is true for decreasing the pressure. Concentration Changing the concentration of a chemical reaction can affect the equilibrium position. Increasing the concentration of a reactant will shift the equilibrium position to the right, favoring the products. Increasing the concentration of a product will shift the equilibrium position to the left, favoring the reactants. The opposite is true for decreasing the concentration. Applications of Chemical Equilibrium Chemical equilibrium has many important applications. For example, the production of ammonia, which is used in fertilizers and other chemicals, relies on the principles of chemical equilibrium to maximize the yield of ammonia. The production of ethanol from glucose relies on the principles of chemical equilibrium to control the extent of the reaction. Chemical equilibrium is also important in many biological processes, such as the regulation of pH in blood and the functioning of enzymes. Calculating equilibrium constants Equilibrium constants are a fundamental tool for understanding chemical equilibrium. The equilibrium constant, K, is the ratio of the products to the reactants at equilibrium with each concentration raised to the power of its stoichiometric coefficient. The equilibrium constant is a measure of the extent of the reaction and is dependent on the temperature and pressure of the reaction. The equilibrium constant can be calculated using the concentrations of the reactants and products at equilibrium. For example, consider the following chemical reaction. A plus B C plus D. The equilibrium constant, K, for this reaction is defined as K equals C D a B. Where C, D, A, and B are the concentrations of C, D, A, and B at equilibrium, respectively. If the concentrations of the reactants and products are not known, the equilibrium constant can be calculated using the initial concentrations and the change in concentrations at equilibrium. For example, consider the following chemical reaction. 2NO2G and 2O4G The equilibrium constant, K, for this reaction is defined as 